All right, so there's this house for sale online that's gone viral on Twitter because of the 3D virtual tour. I ain't got any idea why it's gone viral. All I know is that the 3D virtual tour is apparently wacky enough that it warrants its own game. That game simply being, find the bathtub. I can show you the world. Foul festering Packages, boxes, boxes, boxes. All right, let's find this bathtub, everybody. Oh, wow. Love what you've done to the place. The wonderful foam packaging strewn across the room. The casually discarded Santa decorations. And especially the inch of grime covering every surface. Mm. And a massive HDTV hooked up to a state-of-the-art VHS DVD player and a VHS DVD player. There's nothing quite like a massive high-definition display to really make that standard-definition VHS pop. Ooh, a room-temperature tub of butter. Several cat hair rollers, which, uh, seem to be unused. And a litter box. <gasps> that means there must be a cat around here somewhere. Tiny cats? Yeah, not so much. Okay, love the living room. Let's move on. Interesting bookshelf placement. Ah, yes. Happy Hollow's Giving, everyone. Thanks, Ween. Oh. Oh, gross. Monster energy? How do you expect to get properly lit with a drink that's FDA approved? If it doesn't nearly kill you, how is it supposed to make you any stronger? Yeet. Energy drink. A little death in every can. Rate my battle station. All right, okay, well, uh, it's got five years of tax receipts, no cat treats, screens facing every wrong direction, and, uh, window seven. Eh, I'd say a solid six out of ten. Moving on. What do we have over here? Oh, so this is where the magic happens, huh? Oh, this bed looks real used. And the mess? Who leaves their place this messy when they're taking pictures for a real estate ad? All this crap ain't making me want to drop 300k, let me tell you. Except for this truckload of St. Patty's Day lays. <laughs> Very nice. Ooh, instant lunch. Beef flavor, my favorite. Oh, thank God there's another enormous TV. Gotta have something to distract yourself from the filthy reality you live in. <gasps> Kitty! Hey there, guy! Aren't you just the most precious loaf? <laughs> little nubs. <laughs> Look at them. What the hell are all these boxes? What is your owner keeping in them? You shouldn't have to live in a place like this. I'll get you out of here, I promise. But first I have to find the bathtub. I'll be back for you, I, I swear. I'll be back for you. Oh, wow. What a family photo. Dang, that looks like it's straight out of a meme. Look at that quintessential awkward hand resting on the shoulder. Mmm, classic. All right, where's the bathtub? Ugh. <sighs> Stairs! I think that's it for this floor, so, uh, must be down here. Ew, 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 minions floor mat. Oh, wow. When minions are the first thing you see when you come into someone's house, you should probably just leave. Oh, a vacuum that obviously is never used. Ew, look at the state of that switch. Light switch? Grime switch. Looks like this is your average laundry room. Oh, God, this chair is just oozing tetanus. Here we have the cleaning equipment, which generally should not be cleaner than your house. Oh, wow. Knob Creek gun range. Lovely. But no tub. Next. Lummy. Hmm. Oh, bathroom. This is, this should have a bathtub. No. Why would you have a bathtub in your bathroom when you could have two toilets without stalls? Little intimate, don't you think? Sure brings a whole new meaning to the phrase business partners. Get it? Because they're doing the business together? I hope you're laughing because that's a great job. Ah, another bathroom? Looks like this is the ends room. Why would you have gendered bathrooms in a house? And why is there a urinal with a rug underneath it? Gross. Ah, hey, is that toilet paper roll on top of the holder? What kind of good for nothing nasty boy was so lazy that he put the TP on top of the roll rather than just swapping them out? Jeez. Oh, wow. Hand soap brand hand soap. But, uh, still no tub. Looks like we got some bedrooms down here. Welcome to the man cave. Wow, classy. Oh, but wait. Looks like the man cave has been crossed out. Uh, Z, O, N, Zone. And uh, two L's. I, is that an I? And a K. Kill Zone. Welcome to the Kill Zone. I bet you at least two nickels that whoever sleeps in this bedroom thinks Call of Duty's the best game ever made. Oh boy. What man cave is complete without six bottles of man musk? A box full of partly full man pill bottles. And two stacked man screens. But alas, no man tub. Moving on. Let's see what the other bedroom's like, huh? Wow, a whole lot less stupid. Kind of eerily empty though, if you ask me. Hold on, is that? It can't be. Oh, Hillside Swim Team? That's my old swim team back at Hillside High. Wow, 
What a chip down memory lane, huh? Where the heck am I now? Another kitchen? With boxes full of CDs? Ew, 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 ew. Toothbrush in the sink. Oh, there's so many boxes. Some weird packaging machines. Okay. What's up these absolutely filthy steps, huh? More boxes? Come on, what is this, some kind of cardboard-based hellscape? Oh, look, another vacuum they don't use. Some very dirty looking CD buffing machines. Interesting. Oh, a bunch of computers. Is this an office? One, two, three, four desks. Is this like a real office where real people really come to work? Sweet Detroitus, this place is disgusting. Why would anyone choose to come work somewhere like this? They've got decorations up, but they can't seem to decide if it's Halloween or Valentine's Day. Slay the day. How inspirational. And it looks like they got some bags hung up here. Could be for a bet on which team's winning the cup this year, I guess. Some friendly office betting. What a nice non-toxic work environment. I mean, it's toxic mold, but at least you don't hate your co-workers. So I'm assuming this is some kind of break room then? What's going on over here? Where am I going? Another gendered bathroom? Please be a tub. Please be a tub. Please- Damn it! Ugh. Instead, we've got a urinal with a stall? Okay, so so let me get this straight. So someone looked at the tandem toilets in the other bathroom and was like, yeah, nice. But then they saw the urinal and were like, nah fam, we're gonna need two walls and a door on that shit. And a rock. Ugh. Oh, look, another vacuum that's never used. Moving on. There are so many DVDs and so many boxes. I'm supposed to be finding a bloody tub, but instead I found myself in the middle of some kind of DVD smuggling operation. I have an awful feeling that this is gonna take a lot longer than I thought it would. So let's speed this up a little, shall we? What are these? Little fashion silhouettes? Ugh, people will collect the stupidest things these days. Speaking of which, pop vinyls. Hey look, it's where Harry Potter lives. Harry, where's the tub, Harry? Eh, must be out. Dead end? I think I'm lost in an actual maze. Meow, let me out, let me out! Another dead end. This ain't looking good for my sanity, folks. Oh, come on! No, it's okay. Rule of threes, right? Wrong! Wow, this must be where the piracy kingpin sits on his wheeled throne. Oh. Oh, a door. With stairs? To nowhere. Ah! Stairs. Are we... Are we upstairs or are we downstairs? I've never felt more lost in my life. Oh, oh no. We've been here before. Uh, I checked over here. Look. Look, there's the stupid little fashion silhouettes. Uh, what about over here? By the... Lanyards? Why? Yeah, cool. Stairs. Where's the bathtub? Call the sack! Have a new husband by Friday. Eh, that's no good. I need him on my desk by Thursday. Another dead end. I'm sorry guys, I can't do this. I have to move on with my life. I spent like, what, an, an hour? Looking for this stupid tub and I'll, I'll never get that time back. Honestly, don't even bother liking and subscribing to this channel, man. I don't deserve it. I'm probably just gonna go find my own bathtub, grab Chill's hairdryer and- Is that what I- Think it is? Oh, yes! It's a tub! Oh! Like and subscribe, baby! We did it! This tub's a whole freaking room! It's got like three shower heads! It's the only shower in the house. And there's like at least three people that live in this house, judging by the three bedrooms we saw earlier, who have to walk through an entire DVD Pirates Purgatory just to get to the only shower in the house? What? Also, there's three shower heads and three people. Coincidence? I hope so! Alright, it's- it's time to leave this cursed place. Wait! A second. I think I'm forgetting something. The cat! That little loaf of bread ain't gonna break himself out! I'm coming, buddy! <sighs> oh, I- uh, I'm back. Sorry. I was, uh, I was gone- I was gone so long. I'm sorry. Okay, uh, let's blow this pop stand, huh? Uh, it's okay now. I got you. Let's see what's on the Twitters today, shall we? Whoa, Daddy Pleb says, Get my grandmother out of your basement. I'm calling the cops. Hey, pal, this ain't my house. I don't know what goes on in that basement. I just live here. Next time on Viral Virtual Tours. Find the old lady in Bruce basement.
I think it made Furry Jack even worse. So now I must show Grill Burns even though he doesn't have the context for it, Lamau. Well, Jack, that's- that's gotta be the worst Batman costume I've ever seen. Now go get me those pictures of Spider-Man! Yo, Grill. Do you want a new yeet drink can design? I would love to make one. Hey, I can't guarantee that the manufacturers of yeet are alive, let alone willing to take designs. But you give me your best and I'll do my best. And that goes for all of you. I'd love to see what yeet designs all you talented people can come up with. Alright, show's over. You know the drill. Like this video, subscribe to my channel, give me your first board, and tweet me, you cowards.